Hey guys, welcome back to Zara the Bestie. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a bookmark. Okay, so I'll show you one of my bookmarks. Just one sec, I'm going to get one. Okay, so there'd be, uh, I'll show you a few types of bookmarks that you can make. So look. Okay, here. So this is an alien bookmark that I made. I also made a unicorn bookmark. Uh, I don't know what has ones. <sighs> so I'm gonna be teaching you how to make them. Yep. <clears throat> okay. So first, you're gonna be needing us. You're gonna be needing some scissors, a pencil, or like a marker, a black marker, or anything. Uh, you're gonna be needing some. You're gonna be needing something that is a square, and you're gonna be needing some glue, okay? And you're also gonna be needing some paper. Uh, I don't know if you guys could see. There. Okay. Let's get this started. So first you're going to be putting your scissors and your glue away. And you're going to be taking your square. Actually, no, you need your scissors. So if you have whole, like this type of paper, lined paper that has this, you're going to be cutting off the whole side. So there's going to be a red line or anything. Okay, and you're going to cut that off. Okay, I got it cut off. See? Now just like this. Now you're going to be taking your pencil and your square based object. And you're going to be putting it anywhere. Look. So first I have it here. But look, it's at the side. Turn. Uh, I can't really see. There, see? It's at the side. So you're gonna be like tracing it like this. One second, I'm just gonna trace it and I'll show you how it's supposed to be. Okay, so here you go. Uh, see? Right there. So you're not supposed to be doing the bottom line. Just the uh, like top. Okay, so I'll let you do that. Okay. Now you're gonna be doing a whole bunch of those, okay? So I'll do that and I'll come back. Okay. So see all of those squares that I've done? So now you're going to be cutting those out. See? Right there. It's alright if you use uh, blank paper or lined paper. You could use any type of paper you want. And by the way, guys, I almost forgot to tell you. If you're watching, please subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And stay tuned for my next video.
and also like Guys, so I'm like filming this video because I've been doing crafts and it is late night right now. So let me show you. See you guys, it's night. So I'm actually pretty tired. I think it's like nine. I came back to my friend's house. So guys, the reason why I don't really post videos, I don't really know what to post. And when I come up with new stuff, I post them. Okay, so I am done all of my squares. Okay. Now, so if you, when you have your square, you're gonna fold it like you're doing an airplane, okay? One sec, I'll show you what I mean. So you're just gonna do this, okay? And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your scissors and you're gonna you're gonna cut this off. Okay, so now you have this. These are actually really easy to make too. And then you're gonna take your glue stick and you're gonna like just like unfold one and you're gonna like take a little glue on the side. There. Uh, then you're gonna press it down and there. So I'm gonna be making a unicorn bookmark. So what you're gonna do if you're doing a unicorn bookmark, you're gonna take a sheet of paper. Just one sec, I'm gonna go get one. Okay. Okay. And so first, what I'm gonna be doing, where did I put my bookmark? Oh. Okay. So what you're gonna be doing, you're only gonna be cutting out one thing if you wanna do a unicorn bookmark. You're gonna do like a little horn, obviously, like the... So you're gonna do a small one. You could do like any size you want, but don't do it way too big. Or else like, it won't really be good on your bookmark. If you want it to be like really big, you could. So look, I just gotta cut out. There we go. And then you're gonna be gluing this, but look, not like this, right? You're gonna be doing it at the back. See? Like that. So I'll do that. So you, you could do this any way you like. So if you're doing like, uh, what's it? If you're doing it like, never mind. Okay, because some people do at the bottom, but I've never done a bottom one. So maybe I'll figure it out and I'll take and I'll make a video about that one. There you go. There you go. That's like it. Turn it a little sideways. There we go. So here's a unicorn bookmark. So I'm gonna color everything. So first we're gonna do the eyes. Where did my pencil go? There's so many papers. Look, I have so many papers on my desk right now. 
Oh wait, I just found my pencil. Oh right. So okay, I'm just gonna move this. Okay, finally. Okay, so first I'm gonna I'm gonna be drawing cutie like closed eyes. Okay. Oh, sorry, I feel like something just happened. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we're gonna draw the so you could do any type of eyes you want, but I'm gonna do like shut eyes. Like, look here. Let me show you what I mean. Darn, okay, yeah, you know what, these look really bad. So you go on your unicorn, you're going to do any eyes you want, okay? So I'm actually going to do a winky. So I... Like a really open eye. So I'll show you what I mean. Darn, there's still a little left here. So first I'm gonna do a shout out. A cute eye. There we go. This is what I mean about my eyes. And then now I'm gonna do my mouth. So I don't, this is how I do the mouse. You could do it any way you like. And now I'm gonna be doing the hair, so I'm just gonna get the markers I use for my hair. Kinda of looks like uh red. So let me show you what I mean. See over there. Yeah, it kind of looks like red. So I'm just gonna use that. So I like this. Now I'm gonna do the hair. So first, I'm gonna grab the yellow. And I'm just gonna do like a wavy line down from the point. And then I'm gonna do use a red. The orange, the pumpkin thing, and I'm gonna go like tracing that, but more farther and coloring the farther person. And last but not least, the pink. I'm gonna be using this, going down and farther. And you could like mix them up. So like, I'm gonna put a little red and the yellow. No. A little red and the pink, a little pink and the yellow. Yeah, I also use purple, which I don't know. Oh, it's right here. Huh. I don't know. So, so I'm gonna color the yellow with purple because it looks so much more better. So I'll uh, I didn't. I really don't like the hair, but yeah, that's fine. Because I want to restart, just because I don't like it. Mm. 
And I'm also gonna color the nose in with like just my pencil. And I'm just coloring. I'm just gonna add like mini eyelashes there. And then I'm gonna use the colors that I use for the hair to color the horn. You could really use any color you like for your hair. Not gonna lie, but this is like really the ugliest unicorn. Corn uh, bookmark that I ever made. Okay, now you're done. You could color the skin if you like, but I don't like coloring the skin. So there you go. And now, if, uh, if boys are watching this, I'll show you how to make a alien one. So first, so you're gonna have another square. You're gonna place. Uh, and you could also do a glue earlier. There we go. And then you're gonna grab your scissors. So you're, first you're gonna be doing all these steps again. So look, so you're gonna make sure like there's no white at the bottom, okay? So I'm gonna keep on cutting until there's no white at the bottom. That, which is just a little bit more. What oh, can I get this right there? There. No white. So now, if you want to make an alien one, you're gonna be grab. You're gonna be grabbing your sheet, just like the thing that you did in your homework, and you're gonna just draw squiggly lines, like cut out squiggly lines. Uh, this alien could also be for girls, and the unicorns could also be for boys. Like these are like for anybody. So see, like it's squiggly. So I have one right there, and I'm gonna do another one. So it doesn't have to be the same thing. See, this one's a little different. Mm. So I'm just gonna put this sheet aside. Sorry. Uh, where would I put my other one? Oh, it's right here. Look, so, look. Since I made this more skinnier, I'm gonna also make this one more skinnier. It's okay uh, if like your alien has like more fatter ones, you could just make the other one fat. Oh no, this is way too short. Here, I'll just use this. It's 
this the perfect size? Oh my god. All these are way too small. Okay, here. This has to be it. This has to be the perfect size. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm gonna try one more time on here because it's actually kind of tall. Sorry, it took a little long. I couldn't find the perfect size. This is just a little bit small, but that's okay. So you're gonna take your tentacles, you're gonna take your glue. Like, I don't know what they're called, but yeah, you're gonna take these. And you're gonna take just a little bit, like, like just like uh, this much. And you're gonna glue it. There you go. And, okay, one sec, guys. I think someone just came out the door, so I'm going to go check it. Just going to pause. Them. Sorry, guys. It was our neighbor. They just gave, came by and gave us some food, which was actually really nice. Okay, so look, you glue this part, right? So that's actually starting to look like one. And guys, if you're like, so if your decorations, like the things that you cut off and add glue it onto this, okay? You, if they fall off, you could just glue it back on again. Because I feel like one of my tentacles are going to fall off. Yeah. There. And now I'm going to do, oh, where's my pencil? I'm going to do, uh, I... In another eye. Sorry guys, just there's something wrong. Oops, done. See, my tentacle just fell off, see? So I'm just gonna go back on. I didn't really get that much glue, so I knew my tentacle would fall off. There we go. And I'm just gonna color this in. Sorry guys, is there like something wrong over here? So I'm just gonna like, do my eyes somewhere else. There's like something wrong. I think I got a little glue over there. So yeah. Oh my god. There's like something wrong with this tentacle. It just won't stick. Just no. So cold. Oops. <laughs> Come on. Stick, it just stuck to my finger. Come on. But you know what, there's, this one's like a total mess up. <sighs> there. I 
another wink. I did another wink. So I'm going to do a nice alien. And now I'm going to color everything with green. So I'm going to color everything on screen. Okay, so I got to hold on this one. No. Except your eyes, okay? And I'm also just going to color my tongue that I did. There, so. Yeah. I almost used my pencil. There we go. We're done with our alien. So see how I did it? I had a mouth that added some eyes. And I added these things. I don't really know what they are. And I just green. And easy. There we go. So these are our two bookmarks. Oh darn, sorry. These are our two bookmarks I made. I'm gonna show you one more, okay? So, hmm, what should, okay, here. So, you're gonna repeat the same steps to do the airplane. Yeah. Oh, I glue. So guys, look, so I got this. Now what I'm gonna be doing, gonna grab this. Wait, I'm gonna see. Okay, so I'm gonna grab this, and I'm gonna draw. A, so open eyes with tears. Okay, you're gonna see. Okay, there we go. So I'm not really good at drawing tears, but there you go. And then, uh, oh, you're gonna think this one's crying, but it's actually not. It is crying of laughter. So this one's actually really easy. I'm gonna just color in the tears. Color in on the tongue. And just color everything except the eyes yellow. Because then it just becomes an emoji. Cut 
kind of like, I actually like doing this one. It's actually really super duper easy. You guys should try it. There, so easy. And there you go. So these are the three bookmarks I've shown you. There you go. Three, all three bookmarks. So comment down below and write down which one your was your favorite. Number one, a unicorn. Oh, sorry. Number two. The alien and number three the like emoji and guys look I'm gonna show you how it goes on books so I'll sh so I'm being a diary of a wimpy kid okay this is book is kind of weird okay so the diary of the wimpy kids okay I'm just gonna open a random page Look, so I'll use the unicorn and I'm gonna open the bottom a little. Just I, I usually just stick my thumb in so it opens and I'm, I'm just gonna put this on here. And there, when I close this, I usually just put, push down my bookmarks. Okay, wait, one sec. I'm just gonna Oh my god, all of these pages are folded. Get this to part of it. Okay, see? And the horn's sitting out, so I could just find that page. work with every one of them so i hope you like my video please subscribe um hit the notification bell and leave a like and comment down below one more time comment down below which one was your favorite 